Hi, my name is Perry Dunn, Flatbed 101 instructor for PS Logistics. Today we'd like to talk about a subject that many drivers have expressed concern over. This topic is how to properly hook and unhook from a trailer. Doing this properly will extend the life of the equipment, create less work on your fellow drivers. Here's the process that needs to be followed when uncoupling from a trailer. Line up the tractor and trailer so it's in a straight line. Apply the trailer brakes first, the red knob. Keep the yellow knob in, foot off the brake. This will allow the truck to release the forward push from the trailer suspension. Once you no longer feel the trailer pushing the tractor forward and all air is evacuated from the trailer, then you apply the tractor brakes. Get out of the truck, roll the landing gear until it just touches the ground. Pull the fifth wheel handle, remove the air lines and pigtail, return to the truck, Pull slightly forward, but not all the way from under the trailer. Dump the airbags. Slowly pull out from underneath the trailer to make sure that the landing gear doesn't collapse. Trailer should be disconnected and be at the appropriate height for the next driver to hook to. Make sure that you perform a post-trip inspection on this trailer and report through the Drop Trailer app. On a side note, some of our owner operators have larger tires, which may cause high hook to the drivers that are hooking up the trailer next. If you're a driver running larger tires, landing gear will need to be lowered at the proper height. Follow this process when hooking to a trailer. Line up to the trailer so that you can back straight up. Back up to the trailer until the fifth wheel touches the nose plate of the trailer. Pull the parking brake. Check to make sure that the trailer is not too high for your fifth wheel. Lower the airbags to reduce friction between the fifth wheel and the nose plate. Slowly back under the trailer. Stop, air up the airbags prior to the fifth wheel engaging. Back up until the fifth wheel engages. Perform a tug test. Set the parking brake. Get out and check to make sure the pin is engaged. Get underneath the trailer to make sure that the fifth wheel jaws are locked. Hook up air lines and pigtail. Turn on your lights. Push in the trailer air supply to take the pressure off the landing gear legs. Roll up landing gear legs. Perform pre-trip inspection as the last step and report any defects. I hope you found this information useful. If you have any questions about the process, please reach out to any of the PS Logistics Safety Instructors. Thank you.